Okay, so this is Holster as you have never seen her before. This is Holster in isolation. <laughs> Can't do it anymore. <laughs> So literally, just to kind of get the boring part out of the way, because this is not what these um, isolation vlogs are going to be about whatsoever. Um, I do not currently have symptoms of COVID-19, nor have I tested positive, so that's that out of the way. But the fact is, I'm in isolation. I wanted to make some isolation vlogs just to give you guys an insight into the life of me in isolation. Apologies about my main uploads on my YouTube channel. I've been quite behind with them. Um, obviously, um, with working up until this isolation, um, it's just been like really busy. And uh, obviously with the release of the Xbox as well. Uh, my isolation started just before the Xbox release as well. So I've obviously been showing the Xbox some love. And I currently look very terrible. Um, I mean, what am I wearing right now? I'm wearing my Lucy Spragan pyjamas, right? Hang on, let me show you. What are those? Socks and slides. <laughs> it's really funny because I used to uh, live in the States for two years. It was so accepted out there. It's absolutely not accepted in the UK. So feel free to roast me. That's absolutely fine. It is literally 12.56. I've had to switch my light on because it's so damn gloomy outside. It's really gloomy. So yeah, it's, it's a really gloomy kind of day. I literally, I don't know how to switch my camera around while I'm videoing. I don't know why it's uh, been like that. But yeah, it's just really damn gloomy. So... The light is on. Um, so what am I going to do today? Um, I've decided, I know, already know what we're having for tea. It's going to be Papa John's because there's an amazing promotional offer. It is, uh, is it like Call of Duty bundle or something like that? It's like twenty one ninety nine. Let me just think off the top of my head because literally I'm doing this for promotional item, basically. Um, I've never had Papa John's ever. Um, so I don't know how it's going to square up to Domino's or whatever, but still. Let me sit down and tell you guys about it. So, my arm's aching as well. Um, yeah, so it's basically any large pizza, plus a side, plus a chicken side, and um, a regular Mountain Dew. I like Mountain Dew, but I don't know, it is um, sugar-free as well, so I don't know what the sugar-free one's going to be like, so a bit of anxiety there about that. But anyway, um, you get one of three promotional items. I believe you can get, there's a calling card. Um, it's called something like the family calling card. There's like a few people on it. God knows what it's about, but it's a promotional item, so I need it. Um, so there's that, and I think there's a little weapon charm as well. Um, I, I believe this is for online multiplayer. I've not read massively into it, but what I really want, right? What I really, really want, right? Um, the massive pizza, the large pizza anyway, <laughs> what am I picking it up for? Um, it comes in, obviously, a pizza box, yeah. <laughs> I'm so rubbish at explaining, but um, it comes in a Call of Duty pizza box, right? Um, so yeah, I'll have to like show you on screen what what it even looks like. So yeah, obviously it'll like be used, but when I ring up, I want to ask. I'll, I'm even willing to pay. I want an unused Call of Duty promotional Papa John's pizza box. So that is literally the whole point of me having Papa John's for tea, because I want that. Will Holster get the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War promotional pizza box from Papa John's in her collection? The suspense of these vlogs is killing me already. Um, I've been meaning to um, set this up as well. Um, oh, everything's just reversed. This is awful. This is really amateur vlogging here, right here, guys. Um, but yeah, I've got a nice illuminated Xbox light. Um, I ordered this when I ordered a few things from Very. I just basically thought it'd look awesome on display, so I want to set that up um, in the front of my TV. I'll clear some stuff out from the front. I've basically got like Lego models at the front of it. I've got some like horror models. That is basically how it's looking. Uh, the it clown's fallen down. Ah, uh, hang on. Can it, can you even can you guys even see? That's it. I think I'm trying to look in the reflection of the TV to see if uh, you guys can see this. There's Chucky. Ah. Uh, Everything's falling down. The Gremlins, there is um, Jigsaw, uh, there's Freddy Krueger, Jason. These will be appropriate soon. Joker and Harley Quinn um, clearly heisted and robbed stuff. And basically like a, a pride Batman. I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's basically on there. That's um, my Pokeball for my Pokemon Switch game. You can like throw it to mimic catching the Pokemon. Call of Duty PS4 controller. Um, and then I'll just quickly show you this as well. Um, I got this from a car about ages ago. The brand is Kinnerton, and I believe um, it has a Sega logo on as well. Um, 
I think Sweets originally came in this, and it's a really nice Sonic money box. I, I thought it was really cool. Really nice quality as well. So that's why I got that. I got it for like four quid. It goes for a little bit more on eBay. Um, yeah, I need to kind of put these in a... Um, a nice place once i've cleared my computer table there's like lots of um pokemon cards to sell and things like that on there but um yeah this is basically george ross retro reselling um i think he's dropped his name from his um youtube account so i think it, his account is now just called retro reselling um he's one of my favorite um resellers on youtube he's absolutely awesome he's uh kind of a bit like me but i mean well i mean kind of i'm a bit like him but on a smaller scale he's one of the big guys um i'm just a part-timer um yeah, oh my god. I read, I read it, my missus doesn't see it because it's just, it's so bad. She'll be like, what the hell am I with? Seriously. But, um, yeah, why not, guys? I'll just kind of show you how chaotic it is in here. Um, that's just empty. It's just lots of packaging. So this lot is like all eBay stock, basically. Um, got some retro games on for sale and just other stuff. Um, oh, I'll have to show you my Nike soon as well. Um, yeah, basically, it was kind of like fate. Like the, the day before I had to go into isolation, um, I nipped to Asda. Because I'd run out of my uh, famous Jack Daniels honey. Uh, so I got one of them. And I got another one. Because my mum wanted to get me one as a bit of a stocking full of Christmas. So cheers, Kaz. Um, I, yeah, it was kind of like fake. Because I stocked up on my Pepsis, my um, JD honey, uh, my sugar-free monsters. So yeah, we're, we're pretty sorry for drinks in here, guys. It's, um, it's pretty decent. So you've had a, a very mini brief tour of the room. Um, so yeah, I'm going to play a bit of Call of Duty multiplayer online and then I'm going to have a bath and yeah, just just sort this mop out and everything. And uh, yeah, we'll get some fresh gear on and then I'll show you a bit more around the gaming cave and tell you what I'm up to today. Right, so I've had my relaxing bath listening to Lucy Spragan. Yeah, it, it took me ages because I was literally, um, I was playing loads of Call of Duty multiplayer online. Oh, I can't believe how early you unlocked the AK-47. I need to stop going on a tangent anyway. I'll, um, you know, talk a bit more about COD and Xbox in a bit. I am starving. That feels better, even though I look absolutely terrible. But this is me, this is my natural hair. This is holsters you've never seen her before on this channel. I am so starving. So I may have an odd cake with a, a cuppa just to keep me going till the Papa John finale. The odd cakes are awesome. And they are vegan. So my missus is vegan. She got me into them. So yeah, they're part of my uh, gaming fuel, gaming snack stash down there. I'm feeling some uh, Ben and Jerry's from Papa John's as well on top of the uh, the Call of Duty bundle. So yeah, this is basically my life. Um, not a bed full of pugs, but what is on the bed? Yes. <laughs> New Xbox games. So uh, yeah. Assassin's Creed Valhalla, uh, my hometown Grimsby is actually on this, which is awesome. I haven't reached it yet. Um, there's a massive glitch in this when you're setting off to invade, basically. Um, the sails all fall down and everyone just stays where they are. So massive, massive glitch that actually stops you from pro progressing. So this is actually, you know, just chilling at the minute till Ubisoft uh, patch it. Watch Dogs Legion, not yet started it. I've installed it and everything. I actually got this for like, it was like 50 quid, but it's from CEX with credit. So it literally didn't even cost me half of that price. So looking forward to starting that. And of course the beloved latest installment of Call of Duty. I absolutely love the Black Ops games. I absolutely love Treyarch. So yeah, I'm absolutely loving it so far. And the Xbox controller feels amazing. I'll have to show you the Xbox like properly in a bit or on like another vlog or something. I think we should set up the Xbox sign. Okay, I've no idea how this is gonna look because obviously I have to just leave it resting against some random boxes and stuff. So I've just kind of got a hope that um, I managed to capture this because <laughs> I'm only doing one take. It should do, it should be fine. So let's take all the light and run it out. It'll be really straightforward. Oh, it's via USB, so actually I might... Oh, shit. I've had this for about like two or three weeks on touch. Look at the B. Oh, let's have a look a second. Because, yeah, I was a little bit wary. You, you know what I'm like? With me being a collector, with boxing stuff, it's a little bit bashed in. You can see in the corners and stuff. Like, you'd think the big companies... I mean, I know, like, Amazon and place are guilty of this as well. But, um, yeah, this was from Very, as I mentioned. I was ordering Christmas presents from there anyway. Um, and I also had a 15% off code, and that's also why I, I ordered my uh, Black Ops Cold War from there. Oh, shit. Oh, actually, hang on, hang on. No, that's slanted. Oh, guys. I don't know if it's handled, been handled too roughly, because it's not... Oh, there we go, it's fine. It just popped out, it's fine. I've clicked it back in. This will look awesome. So what I'll do, because the Xbox um, has some ports for USB on the rear of the console... 
I'll plug this in while I'm playing. So every time the Xbox comes on, this gets illuminated. Genius idea. Oh, I need to clear that stuff in front of the telly first, don't I? <laughs> Alright, let's see how we're looking. Just give me a second. I'm gonna have to move this wire out of the way. It is always kind of a shame about the wire when there's like a you know visible wire hanging out, but I'm gonna tuck that behind my uh, sky router, I think. It'll be re just tucked behind there. Okay, we all plugged in. Um this looks really bad. It you know, my, my new Xbox it is kind of degraded to the floor at the moment, but it don't look it, but it has a stand underneath it. I think it is actually meant to be vertical um so yeah it's just it's clearly obviously not going to fit in my unit or anything so you know until i get a proper stand i'm gonna have like a little stand made for it i think to pop it on even though it is already on a a little one but yeah it deserves to be treated with, with more respect all right are we all ready the grand illumination drum roll drum roll please drum roll oh oh uh Nice. <laughs> that looks stylish. I like it. So I've just done it a bit dimmer. I'm not too sure. I'm literally not too sure what these settings are. Oh, that's cool. So it like flashes. You can, yeah, you can faintly see it on this video. That's really cool. I'll just have it on as a solid light. Yes, that looks wicked. There we go. I think that looks wicked, guys. I like that. <laughs> I'm glad I got that. It's just a nice little addition to the setup. Okay, so she actually looks a bit more presentable now. I've basically gone from like a, a 1.5 to a solid 4. <laughs> um, but guess what? I literally, I couldn't record this like before because I was absolutely starving. I got the Call of Duty Papa John's promotional empty pizza box. Yes! I uh, enclosed a message. I had to order it online because you could only order the um, Call of Duty bundle online. So I left a, a message. You can leave like a delivery, a message to the delivery driver. And I was like, please, if possible, could you include one of the uh, Call of Duty pizza boxes for my game collection with like a praying hands emoji? And yeah, literally, after I placed the online order, I'm like, fuck it. I know I'm going to sound like really annoying. And I was expecting some really arsey on the phone or something, but um, I rang them up. And I was like, um, I've just placed an online order. And then they just literally reeled off my address. So I think they obviously the clock on because the, the contact number I was ringing off, my phone number. And then they was like, oh, yeah, is it that? And I was like, yeah, yeah, that's it. And I said, I just wondered, could I just literally have the Peter's box? And he was like, yeah, yeah, no worries. And I was like, oh, my God. I was literally so happy. And yeah, the, the delivery guy came and he was like, here's your order. And he was like, I'll just get back to the car for the empty box. I was like, yes. It's just unbelievable how happy an empty pizza box makes me. So it's just so badass for the collection. So there we are. That is the used one because <laughs> we had obviously the uh, I had the Call of Duty um, bundle. Um, and yeah, this is the unused one. <laughs> just literally showing you all inside the box and everything. So yeah, I'm so happy to have that for the collection. <laughs> I'll proudly display that. So what does the rest of your night entail, Holster? Well... I've just been playing um, some Call of Duty uh, Black Ops Cold War, uh, one of my good friends, Hannah. So, uh, yeah, we've been enjoying the multiplayer on that. I think I'm currently at level 16, I think, 17. Um, so I've not done too bad. I mean, yesterday, um, the post, he didn't bring it to, like, I can't remember if I mentioned this already, at quarter past four, and then it took, like, six hours to install that whopping 130 gigabytes. So I literally had a few games on it last night, and then that was it. I was I was gone. Um, so yeah, I've just been playing a lot more on it today, and yeah, I'll basically be, uh, once I've moved my arcade machine out of the way to sit on my uh, computer seat, I'll basically be um, editing some, um, I'll be editing this, and I'll be editing the, the latest uh, episode, um, gaming pickups and what have you, eBay reselling for my uh, for my channel. I feel absolutely awful because I've kept my subscribers waiting for ages for a new upload, but it's just been mega busy and hectic, and uh like I say, I apologise, you know, I've been slouching about and playing this, but it's just been so needed, this uh, bit of downtime resting. <laughs> so this song is really funny. Um, I basically saw it on uh, Syndicate. He's literally one of my favourite um, YouTubers, zombie YouTubers especially. He's played this in his live stream. Listen to this. <laughs> How funny is 
that? Or it's just literally like, how can this be catchy? How? <laughs> I just thought it was really funny. Yeah, I'm just literally listening to it while I am uh, working on the thumbnail, uh, while these videos convert for me to edit them into this vlog. Um, I I've just kind of done it the hard way because I didn't have an app on my phone. Because uh, I've ne literally never done a vlog before anyway. I thought I'll just, um, but I have to like convert the videos onto my computer into MP4. Because um, otherwise I just can't edit them for some reason. It's really awkward when I get clips off my phone to edit onto here. So uh, yeah, I'm just kind of in the process of doing that and editing the thumbnail. So I'll give you a view of my screen right now. <laughs> Still playing Gillette. Um, so yeah, basically that's maybe the bit of a selfie. I think that's going to go onto the thumbnail. And let me just find the one I want. It was one of my previous ones. I don't mean to recycle it, but I just really like it and it's really appropriate right now. Uh, I want Sean and Ed next to me, so I'm going to grab that. Just take me out of it. There we go. I need to take CX out of it as well. And um, yeah, just come up with some um, other background that is suitable. So yeah, I'm going to slot in between Sean and Ed once I've cut myself out. And now I'll come up with a funky background. And that will be the thumbnail. So guys, this is how I'm going to be winding down and spending the rest of my evening. Playing more Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. And I'm finally going to tuck into a tub of Ben & Jerry's vegan cookie dough ice cream. Finally got a chance to have this. The dessert stomach has finally decided to make room. So yeah, that's how I'm spending the rest of my evening. I hope you've enjoyed uh, the first of, I don't know how many isolation vlogs. I don't know, as many isolation vlogs that I could possibly do. Showing my ever so interesting life and things that I get up to. So I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll see you soon in the next video. Take care. Yeah.